What's going on Clashers? Halo Okerheads here. Just wanted to share with you our Warlog win. 17 wins in a row for the Alpha Kings on fire. Now I haven't been a part of it for all this time, but look at this. Some of the wins are demolishes. We just destroy them. Others are very close, but look at the win um, percentage there. As far as the destruction percentage, 92, 93, 96, 94. So if there was a tie, we would just dominate. So this last win we had, it was close. It was 47, 47. We had a three attacks left, I think, or four attacks. Four attacks left, and we just went to town. This is one of the attacks here. He got the two-star, but I wanted to show you this unfortunate um, two-star that he ended up with. It was a, a perfect attack um, done by Toshibi here. Uh, at first, though, uh, you, those wall breakers just kind of were taken out by the mortar, so that wasn't good. But just looking at the clan here, 17 wins in a row, very solid. If you're looking for a clan and you're a solid player, uh, give us uh, give us a join. Shout us out. Invite. Um, not invite. Man, I can't even talk today, but it's okay. I'm going to keep going with it because, you know, want to show you that I am just as just a normal guy here making mistakes. But anyways, our clan, yes. If you want to join, uh, send us an invite. Try to join. We'll see. We'll see if you're ready for it. Of course, we always want high heroes as possible. You know, heroes make, make and break attacks. I'm doing another video actually uh, tomorrow or maybe the next day, not sure, uh, going to be doing one on uh, Town Hall 10, attacking at Town Hall 11 with only one hero, with only one hero. So uh, be sure to check that out. But look at this. Comes down to the wire. He almost has it. And oh, the Tesla takes him out barely. And he would have gotten that three star. So unfortunate for him, but still a great attack. Sometimes things go um, the way they are because the queen did that crazy walk. Uh, but I just want to show you some other great attacks. Um, King Bob here. Uh, this is just from our last war. Again, our Town Hall 9s are really solid. Really solid. Here he's going to lure the clan castle, do the double poison. But look what he does. <gasps> Drops it not on the dragon. A fatal error on his part. But he did not sweat it. Um, he still was able to get this three star and he you know kept his poise attacked the same way he would have even though the dragon is really taking out his golem there just unfortunate but he was still able to accomplish this three star because those valkyries even level three valkyries they are powerful he brings in four they really do damage um, especially when they get into the center there coupled with the rage and the heal he used his heal right there and it just they just do so much destruction in fact that his hogs you know don't have many structures to take on that are left uh, so very solid attack from King Bob again our town hall nines now um, my attacking strategy I'm gonna uh, I'm not I don't show you a video but a lot of my troops I've even said before they're just I don't have like Valkyries up or my hogs so I bring you these attacks from our other clan mates to give you the options to use these this strategy Valkyries are very powerful our clan loves them and I love them too I can't wait to get mine up and running so they can um, do some destruction for me as well so the last attack I just want to show you is from Osmed uh, or a7 med something like that um, but here he's gonna lure the clan castle again this is a very uh, common strategy now it seems you know dragons are really kind of pointless actually most troops are pointless so, clan castles I don't even know what they do anymore so what do a clan castle does I mean I guess if you have a lava hound in there it would provide more distraction um, but with this double poison it's just really hard to um, you know not kill the cl uh, clan castle it's actually nearly impossible unless you make a mistake like Bob did or something but again here's just a town hall 8 very well done bringing in mass hogs here and look, notice his heal placement. He sh most people would drop a heal right there. He waited just that extra little bit in front of the hogs so they would survive even longer. And that's a pro move right there. That is a pro move to keep those hogs up and not drop those heal spells so early. But anyways, I wanted to share with you our great winning streak, 17 in a row. And I will continue to be bringing awesome, great content. Anyways, guys, thanks again for watching. And I'll see you next time, Clashers. Clash on and Halo out.